Good morning guys, we are at the property. Dad and I actually just got back from an hour and a half drive one way, so three hours total, because we got an excavator. It's our new toy for 24 hours. <laughs> but, so we are going to be digging the garage footing today, and we just, the place that we normally rent from is like double the price to rent like a bigger one than this one, but. So Home Depot actually rents these out for 300 bucks, actually 259. So that's great and we can pull it with the truck and you don't have to pay for delivery. So that's what kind of was the kicker with uh, the place we normally rent from. So we just got back from grabbing it and I wanted to show you quickly what we've gotten done the last little while. All of our rim board is up, all of it and all of our eye joists are up. Some of them aren't nailed over there, but also we put our LVLs up where our stairs go. So, this is where our staircase is going. So there's one LVL here and then two there. So they're all up and I'm gonna get going on digging for this footing. Yeah. And it's a nice day today, beautiful fall day. All the colors are so pretty, but we're losing leaves pretty quick, so. so. there we go, our new toy. You best wear your seatbelt with this one. You can fall out. <laughs> or at least the enclosed one, you can't. Tired in the Okay. Whoa! It towed so easy. Compared to our big trailer, the aerodynamics, like the the wind just goes through it, right? Instead of like a big wall. Well, instead of pushing again, then pull around it. It's too bad we didn't have the uh, like flooring here to start. Yeah, well, tomorrow. <laughs> he look at he wants to be so happy, but he's like stressed he's out. <laughs> yeah, he's sick too, which sucks. to that rebar there and that rebar there. So right now he's just making it so that we can do the floor height and then he'll go around the perimeter and dig the trench for our footings. I might even get burnt today. I'm just kind of hanging out for a few minutes. I gotta go back home and uh, get some dimensions off the computer so we can lay out the sauna tubes for our front porch um, underneath our herd where our front door is going. So there'll probably be a sauna tube somewhere here and then over there as well because the deck is going right in the center of those two windows. 
I took the truck and the trailer back home so that it's out of the way and I walked back and I brought my computer. This is my very first computer because it actually runs the AutoCAD that we use. So now I'm hooked up to long extension cord and I'm gonna try and figure out some dimensions for the sauna tubes and get that laid out. We just had a snack. I had some grapes, dad had some a pear. So, and he's just digging away. Dito's hanging out. Today, you want to go get Damien? You want to go get Damien? Go for a walk? Go for a walk? Yeah. All right, we're here to pick up Dude. Hey, D. Are you excited to see Damien? You miss him so much, huh? Well, we got the little mugger. Let's go see the excavator. I told him it was coming today. <laughs> hey Damien, what is that? It is sunny. What is that? It's an excavator. It's just a small one. Look at this is where the garage is going. Cool, huh? Yep, come on. that we need. What? what? Holy. Yeah, Do you know what type of soil that is? That's clay. So we're just checking because at this point it's like we're at like six foot something um, because that's two feet. But then as we go we won't have to dig as deep because of the grade of the land. So Anyways, that's why I have to keep checking. So that height there is about where we get level. So from my feet over to there. Okay, 
Okay, so this trench is dug for this wall. Now he's starting on this wall. And then we'll have that wall. I just went and grabbed diesel for the machine. I had to take the trailer with me. I took dude and diesel with me. Oh, I'm hauling. Okay, go. okay, so this is how much he's got done while I was gone. That's a good 20 feet at least. And we're still checking with the laser. He was a little high in one spot, so he fixed it. But he's only got about 10 feet to go on this trench. And then... And then he's gonna back drag this. Well, you guys can't really tell, but street light is on. Moon is out over there. It's uh, getting dark and we're working still. I just put away tools before it gets too dark to see. I'm gonna put away this last few minute things. We still need this out. Uh, laser is still going. <laughs> it's weird that you can actually see it because <laughs> every time we've used it, it's been light out so we don't actually see the laser. But anyways, uh, Oh, tape measure. So he's getting there. Ugh. This trench is dug all the way to here. And then over there, he's going as well. So. We found the light button, so he's got you can see a little bit now. Now you can kind of tell it well actually. It even is still brighter in the camera, but. The amount of dirt we have on our property is just absolutely insane. I showed you guys, I think the topsoil back there, but now we have all this topsoil. That's half topsoil, and this is all fill, and all of this will actually have to be taken down. Well guys, I think that is going to be it for tonight. It is now Focus 30, as Jesse and Alyssa would say. Um, I'll have their link down below. They're building their own house, and they've been working on it for a really long time now. Um, three years, I think. Their property and stuff. So, uh, anyways, I'm going to end the vlog here. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And we will see you next time. Bye guys. <laughs>